Hello. Yes, yeah. Hello. Yeah. Hi. How are you today? Oh. Mm. Mm, mm. Bad. What was that? Bad? Really? Okay. In that case, you can say it was bad. Okay. Let's go. Let's talk about this a little. Hmm. Okay. Let me just so wait a second. Then in that case, maybe you want to say, uh, how are you today? And then you said bad, but uh, I would say it was bad. That's better. So I'm going to ask you once more and you answer that way. How are you today? It was bad. Okay, it was bad. Then maybe you can, I'll ask you, what happened? What happened? Do you understand what happened? Um, that's right. That's right. That's the question. So maybe you can tell me what happened. Try, just try. Um. English. Yeah, in English. As much as you can. Just uh, okay. As much as you can. That's as much as you can. Oh. Or maybe you can just uh, say it in Korean. I'll help you. Okay. Ah. Uh, okay. So in that case, we need to figure out. This is English. You just need to say three things. So, what is this in this sentence now? Who? Yeah. Right. So, in this sentence, what is who? Our. Okay. And what do you know that in, in English? What is Hakwon in English? Company. Aha, company. Okay. Just uh, give me a second. Maybe I will open Anki first. This is not yours, and yours must be your Kate, the last one. Okay, I'll teach you a few things here. Don't worry. Just wait. Okay. So you said company. 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 This is company. So maybe academy. This might be hard one. Academy. Mm. It's okay. academy. Okay. Yeah. So now you know what is hard one in English. Academy. Okay. Then now, what happened here? In Korean, what is it? Um. That's right. 
Then, do you know this one in English? Oh. <laughs> this starts with F sound. Can you guess? Finish. Yeah, finish. But now talk about tense. Is it present tense, past tense, future tense? What is it? Finished. Yeah, right. So if you say academy, finish it. What is it? Academy finished. What does that mean? That's right. So now we just need to add one more thing. This. Do you know this one in English? This. This one in English, do you know? Okay, that is late. Then, okay, I'll say Academy finish it late. And what is that Academy finished late? That's right. That's how you do. Academy finished late. Finished. Okay. Then what about... Okay, maybe I ask you why. Okay, what time did it finish? Mm, just wait for me, I'm sorry. Maybe I'll open these numbers. And then this might just work better. <gasps> okay. Yeah, okay, you said. Can you say it again? What is it? Academy. Okay. Hmm. Late. Okay, that's how you say Academy finish it late. Then what about Can you make it? Um no. Then what do you need here? Do you not know? Hagwan or do you not know Kunata or do you not know this? It. Okay, I'll give it to you. That is <clears throat> Ali. So can you make this sentence? Academy. Uh huh. Um. Ali. Okay. okay. Late. Oh, no. You need to say three things here. So I'm going to just open one more tab here and then I'll teach you how we can make sentences. All right. Let's start. So we always need to say this sentence or and then next is this and then all the others. Okay, that's how we make this sentence. So I'm gonna just uh, make one more thing here. All right, let's do it again. So here, can you say it in Korean? Here, which part? This part, what is it? Yeah, right. And then this part. Yeah. And this part. 
No, 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 no. We don't have. We don't have. In here, we don't have. But this one, now, this. And you can just change it like academy. And this one, finish it late. Then this is going to be a sentence, academy finished late. That's how you make sentences. Simple. Then now, maybe I say, um, I want to ask you, why did it finish late? Why did it? Oh, okay, um, I want to change this one. What time did it finish? What time did it finish? Right. Uh huh. That's what time did it finish? So, can you answer this? No. Okay, then now we can practice this too. So this is a sentence here. And I asked you this way, what time did it finish? Then you answer with... <sighs> you answer with it. That's the first thing you need to remember. So, it, and then, as always, you need to answer with the verb here. It finished. And then, now, you need to say, what time? So it finished it, and when? What time did it finish? 7 o'clock? 7.30? What time? 7... Mm. Let me see. Oh, okay, okay, I'll teach you. Don't worry. It finished it, and when this is about time, you use at. So it finished it at 7.30. So which means, uh, is that right? Yes. Okay. All right, I understand now. What time did it finish? Okay, that's one thing. So I'm so sorry that it finished it late. And what time did you come home? What time did you come back home? What time did you come back home? Um, it's the same thing. Uh, what was that? Sorry, say, say it. Huh? Say it. Yes, right. Right, that's right. Okay. Um. At seven. Forty. Forty. Okay. So you can say it's the same thing. I asked you, did you? So you answer I. I asked you, did you come? So you answer came. 
and back. So I'll say I came back home at 7.30. It becomes I and it becomes came. And then you also need to say everything there. Back home. Same thing. I came back home at 7.30. Same thing. It finish it. Same thing. That's how you answer things. Okay, then. Then maybe I make similar question here. Or before that, I want to ask you. No, not ask. Just make this sentence. Um, okay, is that right? Yes. Okay, then. That's good. Then now my question is, what time did you wake up today? Mm. What is this in Korean? It's, it's a, it, um... That's right. Okay. Can you answer this question? Okay, it's the same thing. You just need to say this, this, this. Gonna be the same thing. Then, okay, I said you, then you say I. I said wake, but past tense, so walk. And I said up, so up. All the same. I walk up. What time? At what time is it? Um, it will see. Seven. Seven, okay, seven and then <clears throat> um uh, uh o'clock. Uh seven o'clock, okay. Is that right? Okay, very good. That's how you do. So remember, when people ask you, you, you answer I. When people ask you with the verb, you use the verb. And when people ask something more, then just put it there. I woke up. You wake up. I woke up. You wake up. You wake up. Okay. Uh, you come home. Then I came home. I came back home. Same thing over and over again. It finishes. It finish and it finish it. Same, all the way same. Okay then. Now the next question is, what time did you go to school? What is it in Korean? What time did you go to school? Uh, uh, 당신은 몇 시에? Uh huh. Okay. Could you say it louder? I couldn't hear you just now. 학교에 갔습니다. Okay. This, right? Okay. Can you answer now? 
Ay. Yes. And what's next? Teed. Teed. Oh, just go. <clears throat> um, at Eight. Okay. So that so, so thirty. A thirty, yes. I did go to school at a thirty, but there's one more thing. Okay, now I'll just make something here. I go to school. And what about this one? Go. And what's the past tense of go? Um, Do you know the past tense? I don't know. Ah, uh, I see. The past tense is went. And the past participle is gone. So can you make the past tense here? What is it? I go to school and what about past tense? I went to school. Then what about this? When? Yes, right. It's not did go, it's went. That is perfect. Good. So you can say, I went to school at A30. Is that right? Yes. Okay, that's good. So same thing over and over again. I said you and it becomes I and go becomes a past tense went and to school goes right here. Same thing, same, 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 all the same. Okay, the next sentence is Uh, can you make this one in English? Um, <clears throat> try, just try, it's okay. What time do you do? Uh -huh. <clears throat> Sleep. Yes, sleep. And? Yes, third day. Perfect. Yes, right. What <clears throat> time did you sleep yesterday? Perfect. Then now, what about the answer? Maybe you can answer this question too. How can you answer this question? Ah. Uh. Um. 
I. Uh -huh. Sleep. Uh -huh. Sleep. The past tense. Do you know the past tense of sleep? No, you can say, no, I don't know. <clears throat> no, I don't know. Okay, then I'll teach you. The past tense of sleep is slept. And the past participle of sleep is slept. Okay, so what is it now? Slept. Yeah, slept. Yesterday. Uh, oh, but... Now you need to tell me the time. What time? Um. At. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, good. 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. Oh. oh, I see. And then yesterday. All right. That means. Is that right? Yes. Okay. Okay. Now. I understand. Then now my question is, are you tired? Do you understand the sentence? Yes. Uh-huh, I see. Then what is it in Korean? This sentence in Korean. Okay. All right, that's our tired sentence. And how can you answer this sentence now? Um, yes. Yes, and then? I. Uh-huh. Um, mm -hmm. tired. tired okay that's how you answer yes i am tired it's because the question is here um okay are you yes i am tired uh, can you make this sentence? No. Aha. Uh -huh. Then is there anything you don't know? Ask me, please. Aha, uh -huh, I see. Then you need to learn this sentence too. In that way, you can say what is this way. What is Jolin in English? What is Jolin in English? What is that? That is This is the sentence. This is the question. What is Cholin in English? So you ask me again, then I'll teach you. Mm? Can you ask me this? Ah, what 
is to learn in English. Okay, I'll teach you. This one is sleepy, sleepy, sleepy. Mm -hmm. Now you know. All right, then can you make this sentence? Are you sleepy? Yes, right. Are you sleepy? Right? Then how can you answer? You can answer this question too. Answer me now. Mm. Yes. Okay. I <laughs> yes, I am. M. Sleepy. Yeah, right. That's how you do. I understand. It must be very hard. Okay, that's how you make sentences. Um, how can I say, um, okay, then what about this? All right, can you make this sentence? This. Mm. Are you? Oh, uh, no. This is action. Mm. Did you? Oh, okay. And then? Um. What's the action? What's the action here in this sentence? What's the action? Study. Yeah, right. Did you study? And what else? Today. Yeah. That's the question. Perfect. Did you study today? Yes. Then you answer now. Um, yes. Okay. I. Uh huh. Study. Uh huh. Okay. Today. Today, but look at that. Past tense. Present um, tense. Um, studied. Okay, I studied. Yeah, right. Now, now you made it. Yes, I studied today. Right, that's how you do. Just remember, you can do it. Okay, you becomes I, and study becomes studied. And today is just today. All right, then now my next question is, can you make it? See? Same. But I just put this. What? Oh, yeah. Did you... Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. What did you study today? Right. Perfect. Then, now you answer. 
Um. Uh, I taught him. Uh huh. Uh. Um. Today. Today. Perfect. Yeah, that's how you answer. Good. Is that right? Yes, very good. You're not wrong. You're doing well. You becomes I and then Study becomes studied. Why? Because I asked you, did you? That's why. Past tense. Then, okay, next question is, how long did you study math? What is that? Um, oh. How long is this? Uh huh. Okay. So, of course, I asked you, you, so I'll say, All right. Um, Oh, 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 I'll say this. So I'll say just uh, today here. Okay, let's go. Oh. Uh, I thought it. Uh, did you say at? Um, um, yes. Okay, at and say more, please. Um, five. Five. Um, um, minute. Minute. All right. I'll change a few things here. So what did I say? I said this. Oh, no wonder. Okay. What did I say? This, this, this. So in in English, what is it? Uh, in Korean. So tell me in Korean. This one. What did you? Okay. This, I studied at five minutes. I'm gonna tell you about this. So, the it will change a little. How long did you study math today? And the sentence will be just like this. So, what is 
in Korean, how would you say in Korean? This sentence in Korean, how would you say it? 나는 다섯 시간을 공부했다. Okay. Okay. Ooh, that's a lot. So first thing you need to know is what? Who? Who? Um, I. Yeah, okay. I. And then what? What did you do? The action. Um, study. Yeah. And what? You don't have what in this sentence. No, nothing. And now you need to say the rest. Which is, what is this in English? Do you know how to make this one in English? No. Okay. So that one is four. 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 What is four? What is four? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll teach you. Don't worry. So that is four. And the next one is that is four. So maybe I can make two sentences here. I studied. I uh, I waited for a day. I waited for a day. I waited for a day. So what is I waited for a day in Korean? Uh -uh. For a day. For is. Then what about for a day? What is for a day? Yeah, right. Good. So. Uh-huh. And then. Okay. Hey, uh, Kate, let me ask you something. Um, 오늘 숙제 아직 안 했죠? 제 숙제? 어떤? 그 동사표 쓰는 거 오늘 아직 안 했잖아요. 그것도 안 하고 지금 그 뭐지? 앙키 숙제도 안 하지 않았나요? 어... 아, 네. 어, 그러면은 앙키 숙제는 오늘 뭐야? 평소에 하는데 얼마나 걸려요? 평소에 10분에서 15분. 동사표 숙제는 얼마나 걸려요? 동사표 숙제는 그 추가돼서 20분 정도. 동사표 숙제 다 쓰는데 20분 걸려요? 네, 그 아니 쓰는 게 아니라 그 문장 생각하는 것까지 앞에서. 아하. 숙제를 내 마음 같아서는 빼주고 싶긴 한데 피곤해 보여서 그냥 쉬라고. 이거 끝나고 뭐 해야 됩니까? 또할게 뭐가 있어요? 끝나고 사회 조사 해야 돼요. 어, 친구들이랑 뭐 하는 게 있나 봅니다. 아, 그 수행 그 아니, 수행 평가가 아니라 그 학교에서 그 사회 뭐 준비하는 게 있어 가지고. 아, 그래요? 하... 몇 시에 잘것 같아요, 오늘은? 모르겠어요. 그럼 안 되는데 뭐가 이렇게 힘들지? 왜 이렇게 힘들지? 음, 재밌어야 되는데 배우는 게. 오케이. Okay. I waited for a day. 생각 좀 해봅시다. I waited for a day. 오케이. Okay. Right. So that's the sentence. I waited for a day. Then what about I waited for him. I waited for him. I waited for him. Then what is it? 나는 그를 
위해. 오케이. Okay. 기다렸다. 응. Hmm. Could be. Yes. Okay. So now you said at five minutes, but is it at? How to say it? In English? At, oh, um, four. Okay. Five. Uh huh. Um, minute. Aha, another one. Let's go. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. Minute, minute, minute. This is minute. Mm. And what about uh, what about this? It starts with H. Hour. Yeah. Hour. Hour. Then what about this? Mm. It starts with S. I don't know. Uh, this is second. 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 So, second, minute, hour, day, week, month, and year. Okay. So, again here, four, five, what? Hour. Yeah, hour, but we can count time. One hour, two hours, three hours, four hours, five hours. Okay, so how can you say this one? I studied nothing here. So the last one is four or five hours. I studied for five hours. All right, then let's ask you again. How long did you study math today? I study. Uh huh. Oh, but past tense. Did you? Did. Studied. Ah, studied. Okay. Four. Five. Hours. Okay. Um, I studied for five hours, and then what else? Mm. Beth. Then, what about today? Uh huh. But the problem is, what did I say? I studied, and now you have here mess. So the sentence should be I studied mess, and then the rest for five hours. Chat, 
this is why Korean is good. 이라는 문장을 썼어요. 여기 정말을 빼더라도 요 정도 길인데 여기가 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 여섯 개 단어를 썼죠. 그죠? 여기는 하나, 둘, 셋, 네 개의 단어를 썼잖아요. 근데 봐봐요. 선생님이 이게 영어와 한국어의 차이점을 정말 짧게 가르쳐 줄 건데 한국어가 정말 이래서 좋은 거다. 말 됩니까? 이렇게 말해도 되나요? 어, 네. 네, 됩니다. 정말 좋은 거다. 이래서 한국어가 됩니까? 네. 오케이. 좋은 거다. 정말 한국어가 <웃음> 이래서 완전 뒤집었어요. 그냥 말 됩니까? 그럼 또 어떻게 뒤집을 수 있을까? 이거 경우의 수 해보면 네 개니까 4 곱하기 4 하면 16개 나올 거잖아요. 안 되나? 그렇죠. 그렇죠. 그렇게 나오지 않나요? 근데 네. 한국어는 이거를 아무리 뒤집어도 상관이 없어요. 다 말이 돼요. 그냥. 근데 문제는 영어는 여기에서 뭐 하나만 위치가 바뀌어도 틀려요. 무조건 틀려요. 그래서 한국어는 신텍스가 좋다고 얘기를 해요. 이거를. 이거를 아무데다가 막 껴놔도 다 맞아요. 근데 영어는 조금이라도 틀리면 틀려요. 아예. 그게 영어랑 한국어의 차이점이에요. 그래서 선생님이 이걸 가르칠 때왜 이걸 이렇게 가르치냐면 은 우리나라 말 같으면 은 이거 맘대로 막 갖다 놔도 다 맞아요. 솔직히. 근데 영어에서는 이거를 순서대로 딱딱딱 딱, 딱 써줘야만 맞아요. 그래서 케이트 학생이 기억해야 될건 뭐냐면 은 누가 뭐해 뭐를 이거를 순서대로 딱딱딱 딱, 딱 맞춰주면 문장이 나와요. 그 다음에 나머지 정보들을 여기다가 차곡차곡 쌓아주면 돼요. 그게 영어예요. 그 차이가 있습니다. 그래서 이 부분을 조금 이해해 줬으면 좋겠다라는 생각을 하고 있어요. I studied math for five hours today. 그래서 math를 여기다 못 쓰는 거예요. 한국어면 상관없죠. 근데 영어는 안 돼요. 그렇게 하면. 그래서 그렇습니다. 아 진짜... 수학을 다섯 시간 공부한 거예요 오늘? 네. <웃음> 아난 잘못 말인지 아는데 <웃음> 진짜 다섯 시간을 수학. <웃음> 와 진짜 힘들겠다. 오케이. 음, what can I do? 오케이, okay, um, so you become I, and then study become studied, and then mess. becomes of course just mess same okay that's how it works okay uh then what about this sentence uh Can you make it? D two. Oh, oh no, we talk about this first. How? Yeah, how? Long. Yes, how long? And then? I uh, know. Okay, I'll I'll say whatever you uh, I'll just write whatever you said, say and uh, we will correct that one later. So how long study and then what did you want to say? Um. School. All right. How long study at school? And what else? 
today. I'll change a few things here, but before that, look at that. How long study at school today? Then what about this? How long did you study math today? So what about change? Uh, do you want to change this sentence now? Okay then, say again. How long? Okay. Study. Uh huh. That's good. Oh, perfect. That's how you do. Okay then. Now you answer, please. Um, I started. Mm hmm. Um, or six hours Today. Hmm, but what about this? Um, at school. Okay, so can you say all at once, all together? So start again. Could you do that? Yes. Okay, please. I study. For six hours at school. Yeah, today, yes. So, very good, perfect. All right, so in this chart, maybe I can explain a little better. Uh, okay, now one by one. So what is this? Who? I. Yes, right, I, and what about this? Studied. Okay. Studied. And then what? Oh. about this no. no right there's nothing good and now we need to talk about this so what else can you say here or uh -huh. so yeah and what else so one is this and what else two Um, today. Okay. Oh, no, 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 not today. Two is school. Ah. Uh huh. At school. Uh huh. Right? And maybe I can say three with my friends. Four. What else can I say? I don't know. Okay, 
when, where, who, why, because, because I am a student. And what else? Five. Okay, five W one H when where uh, how ah okay hard and next who how when why where how why I don't know there should be one more here ah what oh there's no no what here 이게 어떻게 하는 게 이거예요 누가 뭐해 뭐를 먼저 쓴 다음에 그 다음 나머지는 자기 맘대로 하면 돼요 그냥 그래서 예를 들어서 여기는 바뀌어도 돼요 얘네는 순서가 바뀌어도 돼요 상관없어요 얘네는 바뀌면 안 돼요 대신에 그래서 I studied at school for six hours with my friend because I'm a student hard 이건 안 되고 <웃음> 얘도 얘는 얘는 문장의 끝에 와야 돼요 그래서 I I studied for six hours at school with my friend. Hard. 이거는 괜찮은데 이렇게는 와도 괜찮은데 근데 방금 전에 얘가 있었던 거 얘는 안 돼요. 얘는 다른 문장인 거예요. 그래서 because는 빼줘야 되고 이렇게는 갈수 있어요. 그래서 I studied I studied hard for six hours at school with my friend. 얘네는 바뀌어도 돼요. 이네 개는. 근데 얘는 다른 문장이니까 안 바뀌어야 되는 거고 대신에 요건 기억해야 돼요. 얘는 절대 바뀌면 안 돼요. 누가 뭐해 뭐를 여기는 바뀌면 안 돼요. 이세 개는 무조건 딱딱딱 딱, 딱 들어와야 돼요. 오케이 그거 기억하면 됩니다. 자 이제 슬슬 수업 정리를 할 건데 여기에서 어, 오늘 배우면서 모르겠다 내지는 어렵다 내지는 물어볼 거나 이런 것들 있습니까? 제안도 좋고 건의도 좋고 무슨 말이든 상관없습니다. 음, 없는 것 같아요. 없는 것 같아요? 요즘 좀 많이 바쁩니까? 할거 많고? 아, 네, 약간. 요즘 그런 거예요? 아니면 언제부터 그런 거예요, 도대체? 예, 네, 음, 요즘 그런 것 같아요. 요즘이라는 게한 달? 아니면 두 달? 아, 3월 2일. 3월 2일? 어, 정확한데? 3월 2일? 왜 3월 2일이죠? 그냥 중학교 들어갔으니까 하... 아, 초등학교 때랑 좀 느낌 다른가요? 아, 네. 많이 아, <웃음> 어떡해 <웃음> 아, 웃을 일이 아닌데 어떡하냐 선생님은 어, k 이 학생 나이 때 완전 똥멍청이었기 때문에 공부를 안 했습니다 네, 팡팡 놀았어요, 저는 근데 그렇다고 그 시대, 내 시대의 아이들이 다 놀았던 건 아닌데 선생님은 좀 노는 편이었어요. 그래서 내가 참그 기분을 모르는 건 아닌데 나중에 힘들었으니까. 근데 어떻게 뭐 내가 어떻게 도와줄 방법이 없네요. 진짜. 참 안쓰럽다라는 생각을 합니다. 오늘 피아노도 갔다 왔나요? 그러면은? 아, 수금은 피아노 안 가요. 조금은 피아노 안 가고요. 피아노 안 갔다 오고 그러면 오늘 수학 학원에만 다섯 시간 있었던 거예요? 아니면 뭐 학교까지 합쳐서 그렇게 된 거예요? 수학 학원이 네 시간이고 오늘 수학 과목이 <웃음> 하나 있어서 그것까지 한 시간 해가지고 총 다섯 시간이라고 얘기를 한 거예요. 그거 아인슈타인도 못할 것 같은데. 아인슈타인 수학 못해요 원래 그리고 오. 아닌가? 과학을 못하나? 뭘 못하는데 아무튼간에. 그러고 알았습니다. 다른 건 없고 그냥 그래요. 좀 얘기라도 들어주고 싶은데 참 그러네. 내가 이러고 또 얘기 들어준다고 시간 뺏고 있으면 또 문제니까. 그래서 숙제하는 거에 대해서는 어머니랑 얘기를 좀 해보고 오늘 숙제 뺄수 있으면 은 빼는 쪽으로 했으면 좋겠네요. 솔직한 얘기로. 어떻게 간단하게 간소화시킬 수 있으면 그렇게 하도록 하겠고 하니까 일단 그러면 은 다른 숙제 하고 있어봐요. 네. 아, 알겠습니다. 네 그래요. 오늘 수업 수고했어요. 네 여기까지 하겠습니다. 네. 그래요. 응, 응.